Hello and welcome back to Memory Lane Gaming. Today we will be starting a series for the Super Nintendo game Battle Cars. And um what was I thinking? I think I'm gonna actually keep it on the Otherwise important. So I, I kind of wanted to do a racing game. And I remember having a lot of fun with this game. Where's my button? There it is. Um, let's go ahead and go with the tealish green. New Troy. It has been a long time since I've played this game. Oh, there's no countdown or anything, it just automatically starts. Oh, I found a disc. But growing up, I had a lot of fun with this game and... Ow. I don't know if I hit him or not. Remember those things. Alright. Well, that's something. It's been a long time since I played this game, so let's go ahead and upgrade that. the dampener. Um, so let's just upgrade our engine one more time. Let's upgrade our discs once, apparently. And missiles twice. Metalhead Mike, better bring your band-aids, and remember to take the training wheels off that heap of junk your press R. Driving. <laughs> Come here, Mike. to uh, actually fight Metal Mike, but I think I upgraded my car a little bit too much, so I'm just too fast for him. <laughs> This game and uh, rock and roll racing. Were a couple of my my favorite ra racing games on the 
on the Super Nintendo. It's been a long time since I've played this, so I don't really remember how the missiles work. Damn. I believe that meter on this side. Oh my god. There we go. Damn. The meter on the side is like a damage meter. Um. Well, I beat the target time. I got a shit ton of credits for that. I think I'll just stick with that. Maybe just hang on to my credits for now. Upgrade my tires. Alright. Dirty Knuckle Ned. Heard you whomped old Buckethead. Well, I can stomp the likes of you before breakfast. Heck, my press R. Happy. Couldn't take me in his 99 stinger. Let's quit jawing and get on with it. He almost sounded like... Like, uh, John Wayne there, didn't he? That was not my intention. I'm actually kind of trying to stay behind him. So I can hopefully, uh, shoot him? I'm nuts. Oh shit. It's getting really fucking far ahead of me. Whoa! Shit! Shit! That fucked me up seriously. I am not going to win this race now. Damn. Being passed around like that fucking sucks. So not gonna catch him. I think I found my drift. Jesus. It's very difficult to control. I didn't mean to switch. I'm not really sure if those are like homing missiles or or what. Well, it kind of seems that way. Yeah? Alright, well, that didn't go well at all. Uh, I guess we'll continue from the track. We don't really need to hear him again. Yeah, 
got it. sworn that was a way to actually destroy him. Not the one I was aiming for. My turn's coming up. Why am I... Maybe I shouldn't be trying to go on. Maybe I should just focus on racing him. really seem like I'm destroying anybody. Earlier I think I was destroying them in like one or two hits. Now I'm just not I'm just hitting them and it's I don't know. Maybe the missiles are more more to knock people out of the way and not so much to actually damage them. so far. Dickwad's back on me. Shit. Losing control. Damn it. Get out of the way. No! I knew that was the end, too. Alright. I'm starting over. Oh, there's my break. Kind of in an inopportune place. Destroyed him. Yeah, I'm focusing a lot on trying to destroy people rather than uh, just finish the race. didn't go too bad. Um, let's just go ahead and do that. I have enough for a dampener. Let's do this! Slowing down a little bit. Because, uh... Trying... Blows ass up. I could have sworn I was able to do. Because if I remember correctly, like later on in the 
in the game you have to fight some something that kind of looks like a motorcycle. And uh I vaguely remember destroying it. At least I thought I I think, I think for this lap, I'm just going to go ahead and just try to race it. That's the wrong button. The button layout is not the best. No, this is the final stretch. You're not gonna fucking beat me. Damn, that was close. Alright, we're done with Catman Doo. Meltdown. I'm trying to destroy that guy. Where'd he go? There he is. Can destroy. Just takes a hell of a lot. I destroyed six of them that time. That money's going into my engine. I don't know what my turbo button is, so... I haven't been able to find it. I don't know what my jump button is. Guess we'll go ahead and do that. I'm not really using my grenades. They're just such a bitch to hit with, so... Dr. Diana. Indeed! I'd quite... I'd be quite pleased to race with you. My car is rather lovely. Don't you press R? Or think press R? Yep. I just annihilated her there for a second. Yes, I am going to destroy her.
Damn it, I need a missile. Come on. Shit. Alright, maybe I'm not going to destroy her. Oh, she passed me right at the end. What a bitch. Okay, maybe I can't fucking destroy the bosses. Because I annihilated her there. I'm sure this gives some people like Mario Kart and F-Zero flashbacks, but I was never actually ever a fan of F-Zero. I don't know why, I just wasn't. Maybe it wasn't arcade enough for me. I don't really like regular racing games, but racing games where you can shoot and or destroy each other. I do like, so I do enjoy games like this in Mario Kart, and I also enjoy games like Burnout. Oh fuck, my car's almost destroyed. Damn! She is fucking brutal! Come on! Yeah! I got her! You win! Going from Meltdown to Fuji! Oh yeah. This is the one that has the uh, motorcycle thing at the end. I remembered it being Asian. Well, that missile ain't coming back. Damn, taking a lot of damage. Stop ramming me! Did I blow it up? I think I blew it up. That was my goal. Jesus Christ! Turny as hell! Damn! What the hell? I don't know what those things were trying to do to me. Okay, I didn't get the target time, but I destroyed six things. So that's good. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat the uh, motorcycle thing. That thingy. I guess it's kind of a tricycle thingy, but whatever. Maniacal Mariko. Bushido is the way of the warrior, the code of the samurai. Feet first is the way they'll take you off the track. Code red, prepare to be crushed. Oh god, she's so fast. Come back! Holy 
crap. If I beat this, it'll be a fucking miracle. I need a rocket! Oh, I launched one already. Come on! Out of the way, bitch! I got places to be! I know your name is Maniacal Mariko, but I'm gonna call you Rhonda. Because you're a bitch. Rhonda's a bitch. And if you do not understand that reference, you have not watched my Road Rash 3 gameplay. Ah, fuck me, that's the end. She turned me around. Jesus Christ, I cannot turn. I'm not even going to survive this lap. Destroyed it. Destroyed it. Yeah, I cannot catch up with her because I am not as fast as her to begin with. The whole reason why I was able to stay ahead of her was because of the fact that I kept launching rockets into her whenever she would pass me, and I was also staying in front of her, so she kept bumping into me. I'm just testing out my controls a little bit. I know it's a little late to be doing that, but... Hmm. It said something about jump, but maybe I haven't unlocked it yet, which is why I can't do it, but... I'm so gonna blow up. Did I get him? Boom! You lose! Really? I didn't realize! Alright, next episode we will pick up here. We will, we will be restarting cross-country so that we can get more money and more credits. But, uh, I hope you've enjoyed my... my attempts at including a arcade racing game. For the Super Nintendo on my channel. Uh, playing Road Rash reminded me of this game a little bit, and I was like, you know, I would like to play that game again. So, here it is, and uh, we will be continuing this. Thank you for joining, and uh, wheels up in five.